and the game of basketball. There are two guys that stand tall above the rest. Two guys that are the best to ever touch a basketball. So I'm gonna take these two guys, get three different versions of these two guys, put them into a head-to-head -head three game series gauntlet match to find out who will reign supreme. Who is the goat of the goat? Who is the greatest of all time? Michael Jordan, LeBron James, three versions of them going in a head-to-head -head battle let's see who takes the crown never let them cause niggas die a lot and lie a lot but i'm the truth that's right i fucking said it delivering proof that you ain't gotta die to get to heaven you so this video is going to be a little bit different than what you guys think I know some of you guys came for the gameplay, but I'm going to be explaining a little bit more in this gameplay. So I know a lot of you guys also been hitting me up telling me, hey, OG, we want you to make a video and telling us why Jordan is still better than the GOAT LeBron James. Well, you have to wait just a little bit longer, just a little bit longer. All right. You know, I know I've been teasing this for a while, but you had to wait just a little bit longer. I promise you guys the next video I talk about LeBron or Jordan and it will be that video. What I'm asking for you guys to do is I want you guys to help me out. I want you guys to be a part of this and I want you guys to be able to interact with your boy. I don't want to be that guy that you can't talk to that you can't even have a conversation with. I want to make this into a debate quote unquote all right i want you guys whoever out there listening to me whoever loves that guy lebron james whoever thinks he's the goat and thinks he's way better than jordan i know most of y'all like 12 15 18 years old you probably never seen michael jordan play anyway but you just seen highlights so so i want you guys to go to my twitter twitter should be on the screen even go to my psn all right send me audio or video clips of you guys giving me your best facts not opinions i want facts i don't want to be like oh lebron runs a four five and jordan runs a four eight i i i don't care about that i want facts actual facts to tell me that lebron is better than jordan i want facts and then another thing, I don't want ignorance either. I don't want you coming on here like, yeah, Jordan's a piece of cock, a piece of poo, and he be boop, boop, bop, and he be. I don't, I don't want that. I, I, I don't want that. I don't want you talking bad about anybody. I just want you to explain why he's better. All right? And if you do, are doing that, oh, gee, you are beeping. You smell like beeping. You, you look like be if you do all that, bro, you're not going to be in my video. I'm planning on putting every clip in the video now if it's a real really 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 good audio clip with really 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 good facts i'm going to dissect it and tell you why you're wrong because nine times out of ten all you guys are wrong all right and as you speak right now i know you may have heard a message i i'm actually debating with a guy right now he just commented on one of my videos so you know what i wasn't even planning on doing this but i'm gonna do it you know we're, we're, we're just talking right now and i'm pretty sure he's gonna delete the comment so that's why I screenshot it. I usually screenshot all you guys' dumb comments. So, because I know once I reply, you guys will delete the message. All right. So let me go ahead. This guy comment on my video, um, Matthew Chapa. That's his name, Matthew Chapa. All right. He comments, OG, why couldn't Michael Jordan beat Magic Johnson and the Lakers in their prime? Sleep. Or Larry Bird and the Celtics in their prime. I'm sleep again. Or the bad boy Pistons in their prime. I'm sleep for the third time. Then he goes on and say he couldn't. He had to wait until they got old. Ha, ha, ha. So, you know, me being the basketball the historian that I am, the basketball aficionado, I guess that's how you say it. I don't know. But look, guys, you got to understand, I've been coaching basketball 
since I was 19. I've been watching basketball since I was five. I've been playing it since I was probably five, too. So I get, I get paid to see and spot out talent and also to read stats, all right? I, I get paid for this. So I go on and comment back to your man, Matthew Chapa. I say, hey, Matthew Chapa, you a stupid piece of... No, I didn't say that. No, I didn't say that. But I go back and comment to him and say, LeBron couldn't beat the old Spurs, which is a fact. Or the old Mavericks, which is a fact. They had Jason Kidd, who was like 65, on the team, starting point guard. Jason Terry was they shot starting two guard. But you know what? Let me let me not get deeper into that. I, I save that for my next video. Ooh, that's some good stuff right there. And then I go on to say, and you're talking about Magic, Larry, and Isaiah? I was like, come on, bro. Think before you talk. You You sound real stupid. LOL. I put LOL behind everything because, you know, I, I, I'll actually laugh after I say this stuff to these guys. I, I'll actually laugh out loud because this is funny. How he compare Magic in his prime, Celtics and the, the Celtics, no, 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 let me, not, let me take Magic out. The Lakers in their prime, the Celtics in their prime, and the bad boy Pistons in their prime to the old and San, San Antonio Spurs and the old Dallas Mavericks. Who wins that game? I'm just going to throw that out there. Yes, Tim Duncan is the probably the greatest power forward to ever play the game. But at that time when he beat LeBron, he wasn't the greatest power forward to ever play the game. He was a decent player, but he just wasn't Tim Duncan in his prime. And when Dirk and Jason Kidd and Jason Terry beat LeBron in the NBA Finals, don't even get me started about what they were. Uh, uh, Dirk was probably the only one closest to his prime and he wasn't nearly as effective or uh, 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 he wasn't nearly in his prime as Magic, Larry and uh, the, the bad boy Pistons was when they was beating Michael Jordan. Now, those two guys are great players, Dirk and Tim Duncan, but are we, are we going to say that Dirk and Tim Duncan... Those two names live up to Magic, Larry, and Isaiah together. We talk about these guys together. Maybe individually they can go back and forth. But together, I don't think they stand a chance. But we talk about that in a, an another video. Ooh, I'm trying to get you guys to understand that you need to bring better facts. Better facts and better thoughts. Well thought out thoughts. If you just send in a clip and talk in that mess, bro, you will get embarrassed on this video. I lie to you not. All right, I don't want you going deleting nothing. I don't want you to guys, you know, doing anything. I want you guys to get embarrassed on this. I want you to come with some valid points, all right? So now, in this game so far, you see, woo, that was a nice little putback slam by MJ. But you see that LeBron just went up. They went up one game to nothing on this Jordan team. So I need to actually get this win to tie this game up. And I think I do do it. I don't remember because we played, we played like I said, three games. And, you know, you know who wins, you know what I mean? Y'all know who's going to win at the end. I'm not going to try to spoil it. But right there, I get a nice little and one bucket. So, like I said, guys, I want you guys to interact. I want you guys to, to come with confidence, man. I want it to be a little debate. I want it to be fun. Then I want it to be real as possible. I really don't want that ignorance. If you come in with ignorance, like I said before, don't bring it. All right. If you're new, go ahead and sub and go ahead and drop your opinion down in the comment section. No matter if you're new or old, give me your opinion in the comments down below. And also, like up the video. If you like this, I'm going to be doing more debate stuff during the year. You know, it's, it's basketball season now. So it's time to talk a little basketball with you guys. It's time to get a little bit more personal with you guys, man. And we can debate anything you guys want. I I'm down for it. I, I love the controversial, you know, events and the controversial stories. And I love to debate. So until the next time, this is your boy OG. Make sure you stay smart and be safe. And I'm out. Peace. It's bait. You buy down to me. You go down for me. You lay down and do the time for me. Sorry, boo. Yeah, I lie to you, but don't you lie to me. It's Lakota, the finesse kid. Boy, who hides me? Told the doctor, I'm a healthy kid. I smoke broccoli. I won't run around your